While the counter timer tax enormous feature set gives you a huge bang for the buck, it also gives you an equally enormous user manual to document all of those features. The good news is, you don't need to wade through a couple hundred pages of user manual to get what you want. You only need a few pages of it to get up and running. The reason for that is every one of the counter timer tax functions is documented as a standalone data sheet. The giant user manual is really just a collection of all those individual data sheets. For example, suppose you want to set up the counter timer tack as a simple single stage up counter that issues an output pulse each time the count is reached and automatically resets that count. We just go to the online user manual which is located right here on the counter timer tack website, select the counter function, Pick the type of counter you want. We want a one stage up counter, which is here on page 25. And here we have our data sheet with everything we need to know for that function. This is our one stage up counter. We just choose the output mode we want. We want a one that counts up and resets automatically when it hits a set point and issues an output pulse. So it's not that one, not that one. There it is right there. Mode C is the mode that we want. Each of these individual data sheets also has a wiring diagram showing you how to connect that particular function, dip switch settings if you prefer to configure the counter timer tack using those, you don't have to, and finally, step-by-step -step instructions of exactly how to configure that function. That's it. In four pages you have everything you need to know, and since all of this information is provided for every function this counter timer tack offers, you will never need more than just a couple pages to get up and running, no matter which function you're using. Check out the other videos in this series for some live demos on how to configure the unit and some live demos of how to use it. And as always, please send us any topics you would like to see covered, or any other comments for that matter. We appreciate the feedback.